Hello, and welcome back to Just an Opinion Movie Review. Today's movie is Shockwave Countdown Disaster. So we start the movie off, uh, we're in Yemen, and um, the U.S. military is watching this van, and there's a, a woman, uh, I'm just going to buy generic names because they didn't really tell me their names. So she's basically, she's the professor, and um, the the cartel or whatever have have her held hostage, but this military is um you know watching her or watching the the, the truck um the, the military end up ambushing the uh the the truck and um one of the cartel guys is like hey yeah you should uh you should set that uh the shockwave uh thing and the professor's like no that's uh not no we're not gonna do that but then one of her colleagues or whatever is of like, okay, yeah, I'll I'll, I'll do it. So he sets it. Uh, he ends up dying, um, and then uh, the shockwave uh, ends up going off, and then thus the shockwave now falls into the ground. The military, the U.S. military, gets gets the professor out, and uh, she's like, hey, no, we have I have to uh, um, stop this stop this uh, shockwave. Uh, machine and the guy's like, no, okay, no, we'll stop it. So these jets come in, they blow up the shockwave. Well, you know, air quotes, they blow up the shockwave, and then the professor's like, you know, the the military guys are like, hey, we did it, and then the professor's like, no, no, we didn't. This is just the beginning. Uh, a week later, uh, we we meet. Um, uh, they didn't give the names for these, so dad and daughter, uh, they're related to the professor. Um, the dad's married to the professor. The daughter is their kid. Um, daughter got in trouble, so now she has to be punished, or she's being punished by having to stay with her dad. Um, they're at this uh, log cabin, and um, they're with uh, with another. Uh, we'll call him student. <laughs> so dad, daughter, student. Um, they're uh, um, working on. Uh, there's a bunch of uh, seismic, seismic activities going on and so they're like okay well we're gonna figure this out um, now the, the the professor gets back and she's t with the talking to the um, general and then I don't know who this other guy is I don't know if he's supposed to be the president or if he's like under the president um, but uh, professors telling telling them like hey yeah uh no that the thing's not done and they're like no we we took care of it we definitely took care of it and she's like no you didn't and so oh, there's another guy in there we'll call him hacker um he is he, he basically i don't know what his job is but he, he he can get the information uh well he works for the works for the government but he can also get the information and, and leaked it out um, so after after the general and well, I'm just gonna call him president. Or I'm gonna call him upper upper guy, upper general, and then general. After general and upper general said, "Hey, yeah, get, you know, get the fuck out of here." Um, the hacker guy comes and finds finds the professor and says, "Hey, yeah, I'm the one who leaked the information." And so the professor's like, "Hey, you should get that information and give it to me." And you know, the guy's like, "Okay, well, it's gonna take some time." So, um, now, now that there's a seismic activity that happens in, uh, California, and so, um, the, the dad and, a tr um, a park ranger go out and, um, go see what, you know, see what's going on, and then, um, the explosion happens, um, so the shockwave, the thing that was going in the ground. So the shockwave, so I, I, like I said, it fell into the ground, and now it's just it's it's got like a drill, and it's digging down to the core, and every, you know as it's going down, it's sh it's shocking the um the earth, and it's causing earthquakes that cause tornadoes or something like that. I don't know. It doesn't make sense. So basically, uh, at, around this point, um, France is basically leveled, um, and uh. So, the 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 troop the trooper or not trooper but the park ranger and the guy go out and dad go out and they go to where uh, the event happened in California and they go oh yeah we gotta get the fuck out of here so they head back um, now now professor shows up to the to the log cabin 
and um, basically it's like, hey, we got we got to take this and we got to go to three different spots to find uh, where the you know seismic activity is happening, and so a big explosion happens. Park ranger gets killed. And um, now that now they're off, they're going to three different spots on for the. Uh, um, oh God, what is it? The San Andreas fault line. And so, um, at this time, the hackers, you know, doing his hacking things. He's trying to get information, and so he has to set up a, a you know a plan to to get everybody to. Or to crash the to crash the website in the government, and then he can thus hack the information. So he does that. He gets the information. He sends it to professor. And so professor now they went to they went to all three spots. The first one they went to, the first spot they went together to get the the um, the readings, and then the next two spots the 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 dad and student go to one spot, and the daughter and Ma, and professor go to another spot. They all get the readings, and then now the, the hacker, like I said, sent the information. So then um, he gets the hacker gets found out by the general, and, and then the hacker's like, "Oh shit, I gotta run!" So he runs, and uh, he ends up getting caught, and then he gets uh, beaten up. To, he's like, "Hey, tell me." The, the general's like, "Tell me where the professor's at," you know, and um, he, you know, the hacker kind of holds out and doesn't say anything. Um, but then the professor calls and goes, "Hey, uh, we need to um, we need to drop a nuke down a hole, and thus it will stop the uh, the um, seismic waves from happening." And so um, the general's like, uh, "No," and then uh, he goes and calls calls uh, the upper general, and the upper general's like. Yeah, you know, if um, we might as well do it because at, at this point, uh, New York is basically leveled. Uh, basically, like the whole world is like being leveled. The movie doesn't really show it; just shows like a couple, couple towers um, um, on fire and stuff. <laughs> the movie is very, uh, very CGI, and not the good type of CGI. So the general tells tells his men, uh, "Yeah, we're gonna we'll, we'll drop a nuke." But uh, we got to tie up loose ends because the information also the hacker gave to the professor has some very damning things on the general and, and the other general. So the uh, the general kills the hacker and his and his girlfriend. And so now um, the the U.S. military sent out to go find the professor. The professor and dad, daughter, and student go are now at the at the um place where they're gonna drop the nuke they head down and then they t they uh, get the nuke ready to go and then one of the soldiers is like all right well now it's time to kill you guys but then uh, the other soldier um, this, the, the other soldier who is a good guy you know he ends up killing the other soldier and he's like yeah no we're not doing that and so they end up running the nuke goes off at the exact time that the the storms coming and then thus stopping all of um, the, the end of the world and also I should say that the general was killed by a tornado um, so movie ends everybody's happy voila uh, my opinion uh, well first I'll, I'll, of a rating I'll give it a I'll, I'll, you know I'll, I'll be generous I'll give it a three it wasn't bad um, a lot of the actors like overacted um, overacted um, the daughter, um, you know, there's scenes where the daughter and the mother, you know, don't get along because the or, or professor, uh, the professor is kind of like, hey, yeah, I had to make decisions, hard decisions, and you know, I'm sorry, I, you know, I had to shut you out, but you know, I had to do this. And I was like, oh, you didn't have to do that, and you know, and she's like, and there's a scene where um, they, they, uh, after. After the, the two groups, the professor and daughter and um, dad and student split up, there's like a big explosion, and the professor's more worried about getting the information than it, looking for the for the dad. And the daughter's like, you know, family is more important. It's like, yeah, I get what you're saying, but.
but <laughs> family doesn't mean anything if the world's going to end. I don't know. And if you're able to do this mission, which, you know, who knows if you, you would be able to in real life, you know. But, yeah, it's, uh, it wasn't bad. It was a, it was a fast, I think, like, hour and 15 minutes. I mean, it, it didn't drag on too much. It was basically like, here's what we're going to do. Here's the middle part, and here's the end part. And so, um, but looking at the exposure, so there's a scene, <laughs> there's a scene where, um, uh, the jets, these, these jets come in to blow up the, the, um, shockwave, uh, thing. And the, um, the same scene is used again. So it's like how the jets, <laughs> did they fly around and they flew back around? Um, and then the, seeing the destruction of, um, France. Um, they they use the footage twice. They're like, oh, and, you know, and, and I know there's like, I think there's what eight billion people, maybe more. I could be wrong. Um, we really, I haven't looked up the the current amount of people, but um, at least when 2010 when I, we were talking, there was like eight, eight billion people. So it's probably there's probably like nine billion or ten billion people now. But they're like, yeah, a billion people on the news. Like a billion people are dead. I'm like. You know, I, I know France is big, but uh, I'm pretty sure there's not like a billion people there, because I think like China like makes up a lot of the billions, and so I'm like, I don't think France has that many people. I mean, I, they have a lot, but um, and um, and this the uh, it they it was hard to explain. It. Like I look, I kept some of the stuff out, but like, how does a shock wave cause uh, sex, you know, make the plates move? thus causing a tornado and it's like I don't know how that works I don't know if that's true that could be true but I I mean I went along with it it's like cool we get to see a tornado that is on fire or someone on fire that causes electricity or has lightning I'm like I don't know um but yeah it was uh it, it, I mean it was it was interesting seeing um the mother, or the, the the mother, as kind of not a fu not a fuck up, but um, the one who makes the mistakes, and the and the father, the daughter actually, like, you know, supporting the dad, like you know, it it was kind of nice to see. Whereas you know, you could use your watch movies where it's opposite, so uh, it was definitely a, a little nice change of pace. Um, but yeah, like I said, that's the movie. I forgot the title. Shockwave countdown to whatever disaster um yeah hope you guys enjoy it maybe i'll see you guys next week